Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to Audio Tips. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show uh, new beginners and uh, users to uh, Logic Pro uh, an overview on pedal boards. Basically, I'm going to open up uh, the pedal board options. I'm going to show you guys what kind of options it has. I'm going to open up each pedal board one by one and basically show you guys what they, what each of them do or each of them are used for. I'll get you guys more a little bit familiar with these, um, uh, especially if you guys are guitar players. So I'm going to show you guys how to open it up. We're going to go to Audio Effects. We're going to go down to uh, Amps and Pedals. We're going to go to Pedal Board. Open it up. It's going to look a little something like this. And the highlight uh, pedal board for today's lesson is a uh, two burner. I'm going to take it, highlight it, take it, drag it to the left, and open it up. Um, uh, basically, it has your low, your mid uh, frequencies, your mid gains, your highs, your tone, uh, bias, squash, drive, and output. It has all these cool buttons that you can do. You can either have it fat or not fat. Um, uh, basically, if you still don't know, if you still have no idea what any of these do, you can hover over it. And I'll give you a little description about what this uh, pedal board does. Uh, tube burner is a versatile vacuum tube overdrive that goes from uh, that goes from subtile, uh, so, sorry, that goes from subtool to scorching with the twist of of the drive. So basically, what I want you guys to do is go throw this on a guitar track, you know, play around with it, uh, see what kind of cool effects you guys can get out of it. Because later on in my future videos, I'm going to show you guys how I use this and how I get a cool effect out of it. But for right now, this is it. I just want to show you guys that. The, uh, pedal board. Thank you guys for watching the video and please subscribe.